Hello and greetings, dear ministry partners. On this final day of our 1231 annual fund appeal, I want to humbly thank you for your partnership and support. Through your generosity, Lutheran Church Charities brought presence, comfort, and hope throughout the United States and internationally. Together we have served with joyful hearts in Christ. I love the words found in 1 Thessalonians 1 verse 3. We remember before our God and Father your work produced by faith, your labor prompted by love, and your endurance inspired by hope in our Lord Jesus Christ. Your partnership with LCC helps us serve the thousands of people God connects us with each year in whatever their circumstances to bring the mercy, compassion, presence, and proclamation of Jesus Christ to those suffering and in need. Our Hearts of Mercy and Compassion Ministry provides a physical and spiritual presence through the giving of hearts to those who have suffered a loss or are experiencing the illness of a loved one, to celebrate a victory, to honor service, or to be an encouragement in the face of adversity. The personalized and often signed heart is a way to share Jesus' love and comforting presence. We continue to place hearts of mercy and compassion crosses and markers at memorial sites to honor victims following a crisis or disaster situation that we are invited to. In addition to the nationally recognized blue hearts, LCC also provides specialized hearts, purple for military service, and blue with the appropriate thin line decal for first responders, such as law enforcement officers, firefighters, and 911 dispatch center workers. The LCC Canine Ministry is a national ministry that has over 130 comfort dogs in 26 states to bring the presence of Jesus throughout their local communities. In 2022, our comfort dog teams responded and deployed with boots and paws on the ground within 24 hours when invited to be present to serve devastated and grieving communities where mass shootings and attacks and wildfires occurred. We also returned to support communities who were still struggling with fear, grief, and loss upon the crisis anniversaries of these events. In addition, we responded and were present at many emergency site visits across the U.S. each week to help those who were grieving sudden or tragic loss, including visits with our first responders. Our LCC Disaster Response Lutheran Early Response Team volunteers continue to serve devastated communities following a disaster with chainsaws, heavy equipment, and servant hearts to help with massive recovery efforts. In 2022, our alert volunteers deployed to Florida for three weeks and served over 1,600 volunteer hours at 95 sites for churches and families with catastrophic damage from Hurricane Ian. In addition, we deployed for two weeks and served 14 sites in Kentucky following massive tornadoes that completely leveled or severely damaged everything in its path. We supported families impacted by a condominium fire in Illinois and helped many residents throughout Northern Illinois and Wisconsin with storm damage cleanup. Each year, LCC Disaster Response also trains new volunteers and conducts basic and advanced chainsaw training for our Lutheran Early Response Team adding to the hundreds of volunteers already active and prepared to respond to disasters of all types. In partnership with you, our LCC Human Care Ministry works through pastors and congregations to provide financial, in-kind donations, volunteers, and emotional and spiritual care for those in need, including scholarships for students in low-income areas to continue ministry-based teachings in Lutheran schools providing food to soup kitchens and food pantries, delivering donated furniture and other household goods for veterans and others in need, financial help for refugees, individuals, and families in crisis, and providing vehicles for those without transportation. We have strong partnerships with churches and Christian mission societies across the U.S. and internationally. In Ukraine, you supported us in helping precious lives impacted by war to provide humanitarian relief and the proclamation of Jesus Christ 
through the dedicated pastors of the Synod of Evangelical Lutheran Churches in Ukraine and the Immaculate Conception Ukrainian Catholic Church in Palatine, Illinois. In Haiti, your donations make a difference between life and death for the most vulnerable Haitians, such as tarps for shelter, school tuition, food, medical support, beds for the elderly, hygiene supplies, shoes, motorcycles for pastors, and so much more. In Ghana, you built wells to provide clean water sources in rural villages. In Ethiopia, you funded Christian school scholarships that help educate and integrate orphans into larger family groups. And in Israel, you supported four homes of mercy who cares for children and adults with disabilities. Every day in big and small ways, through acts of service, kindness, and faithfulness, together we make a difference to people who are suffering and in need. With God's continued hand of blessing, we fulfill our mission to share the mercy, compassion, presence, and proclamation of Jesus Christ in 2023. How will we do this? Together with you. Once a year, and only once a year, we ask you through our 1231 annual fund to support the overall ministry of LCC. This determines the many ways in which LCC can be present and serving locally and nationally. We only go where we are invited and we never charge those we serve. LCC covers all of our transportation costs, materials, lodging, and meals. We never burden the people or communities that request our need or our presence. LCC also does not accept state or federal funds that would prohibit us from proclaiming Jesus Christ. And LCC does not receive district or synod funding. We are a donor-supported, faith-based ministry. All year, 100% of your designated donations go to what you donated for, with LCC absorbing the administration costs if needed. It is truly passed through dollar per dollar for what you, the donor, intended. So today, on 1231, I want to thank you for your gifts, so generously and often sacrificially given, and ask that you prayerfully partner with us to serve others as we continue making a difference to those in need this coming year. From Romans 15, verse 13, May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Thank you for encouraging us and for the blessing you are to so many lives touched by our ministry. May God richly and abundantly bless you and those you love in the year ahead.